what will win in a drag race between the new BMW M3 CS and the BMW M4 CSL? Well, we're going to find out because I'm going to race them over the standing quarter mile. I'm Matt Watson and you're watching Car Wow. Buy, sell, car, wow. Now let me tell you about this M3 CS. It's based on the M3 xDrive, but it's been given the club sport treatment. So the three litre twin turbo straight six has had a power increase from 510 horsepower to 550 horsepower. Torque's the same though, 650 newton meters. It drives all four wheels via an eight speed automatic gearbox with a torque converter, but it does have a good launch control system in it. This car is quite heavy though. It weighs in at 1,765 kilograms and it costs 116,000 pounds. Let's find out about the M3 for CSL from its driver. Hello, Yanni. Can't hear you, Matt. Nothing at all. Can you hear me? Let's try a different channel. Hello, Yanni. Hello, Matthew. I was on the wrong channel. You're on the wrong channel. You're on Car Wow, not Yanni Mize. Hey, follow Yanni at Yanni Mize. Link in the description. Do you like that, mate? Do you know what's really weird? I swear to God, I was sitting here thinking, I wouldn't mind a plug today. And you've done it like you've read my mind. That's unbelievable. Wow. Yeah, just like, you know, peas in the pod, but also very different. Anyhow, a bit like these two cars, peas in the pod, but also very different. So tell me about your M4 CSL. Three litre twin turbo inline six, 550 horsepower, 650 newton meters. Rear wheel drive, eight speed auto, 1,625 weight. It's around 125,000 pounds. Basically, my car has the same engine as your car, but I have the benefit of all wheel drive. But you have the benefit of less weight. Quick thanks to Imran Evolve Automotive, who's lent us that car to drag race. Thank you, Imran. We appreciate it. And usually it's not been tuned. He normally tunes cars. Anyhow, shall we do the customary car wire sound check? You start, actually. <laughs> revs all the way up. No softy in your car. That's because you've got two helmets. See if mine's all right. This sounds pretty good. I think some of the noise is like artificial played through the speakers, but what's it like from your car? Listen to my car. It sounds very soft. Do you want one of my helmets? I don't want your helmet, thank you very much. Someone else is using it. Can we get on with the race now? I've got to say something though, right? We have just filmed a drag race with a bunch of Porsche GT cars. That video is already out. If you want to see it, you can click on the pop out banner up there. I'll follow the link in the description below. But didn't those cars just rev so much more freely than these? That was a good race. I'm not going to lie. That was a good one. You should check that one out. After watching this, check it out. Also, if you're thinking about selling your car to buy your next car, you can do the whole selling of your car and buying your next car through CarWow. Right, the selling part's dead easy. You just upload some photos, give a brief description, then dealers all across the country will bid on your car. You pick the highest offer, they come to your house, take the car away. It's simple and free. And then you can just research what car you want to buy next, check offers from various dealers to move into your next car. It's so simple. Now, if you want to do that now, click on the pop-out banner up there or follow the link in the description below. Alternatively, just after this video, Google, help me CarWow and we will help you change your car. Let's warm up our tyres first. I'm going to do mine. Okay, this is a BMW press car, so they like you to get through the tyres. You see, it's part of the whole BMW PR strategy to make sure that people are still aware that these BMWs, even the latest ones, are drift machines. And can I just point out, Imran said to me I'm not allowed to warm up my tyres, so I guess I'm going to have to sit here like a good boy. Or I can pretend I didn't hear what he said and still do it. You let me know, Matt. I don't think we should do it if Imran doesn't want us to, but I know for sure that the BMW PR team definitely do because they've got too many tyres sitting around their workshop that they need to just get rid of. Mate, you've got a four-wheel drive car, I've got a rear wheel, and I'm going to have cold tyres. How much more advantage do you want? Well, we can also warm up our tyres another way by just like going down the runway and weaving and braking and stuff like that. And we'll do that as well before we race like we normally do. But I want to do this drifting fast cars BMWs. That's enough of that. I can only turn right, I can't do it left. 
Do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna trick Yanni. I'm gonna launch this car for the first race in rear wheel drive mode. Now you don't have launch control in this car when you switch into two wheel drive mode and you have the stability all the way off. So he should win this and it'll give him false hope. Three, two, one. No. Oh wow, he got dropped. He got dropped. Clear victory there, Yanni, clear victory. No excuses, no nothing, just nothing? Listen, I wanna do quite a few drag races with these. I, let's just agree from the outset, we're gonna do best three out of five. Can we just have another run? Three out of five? Wow! What happened to first to three or best of three? Three out of five? Oh, he got dropped again. <laughs> Come on, CSL. I'm spinning up in first and second. Oh, Yanni. I got a good launch, but then you came past me with your superior skills. Mate, this is light work. This is easy today. What's going on, Matt? All right, come on, one more go. If I don't win this, it's game over. <laughs> yeah, I'm happy to make it 3-0. No problem at all. All right, now let's engage the proper launch control. I've now got four-wheel drive and launch control. Three, two, one. See you later, Yanni. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow, that was a different kind of launch, wasn't it? <laughs> Were you sleeping on the line? Welcome to the party, pal. And I'll be honest, that was a different level of launch from you there, mate. That was not, that was, yeah, I don't know what to say. Okay, still, two to you, one to me. Got to win the next one. Good luck. After seeing that launch, oh, I'm not confident anymore. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely bullied in that time. say anything it's two each yeah that seems to take a lifetime to get to launch i guess it's the cider it's really annoying like when you're like so far ahead and then next thing you know you're so far behind i'm not behind i'm level true but you get my point before we do our last race matt are you doing anything different that you did on the first two races i'm pushing my right foot firmer into the mat than i was before mm, okay are you doing something different? It just launches a lot better than the first two races. So granted the last race fine, but the third race, I've done exactly what I did in the first two and how you killed me was a bit uh, weird. Okay, let's just go again. Last time, this is the decider. Three, two, one. <laughs> so much fun. so satisfying i'm not gonna lie to you you may have two helmets in the back but this 
yeah, I enjoyed this more. I'll be honest, I'm not enjoying it. This feels very sicky in this car. You know, when you're accelerating and slamming on the brakes, it makes me feel sick. Yeah, the first two drag races were great, and the last three were dreadful. Just didn't do anything different, so I don't know what happened. It's just weird. BMWs, go figure. So then what exactly happened? Well, the M3 won. It completed the standing quarter mile in 11.1 seconds. The M4 took 11.5 seconds. Now we have a rolling race from 50 miles an hour. The cars are in efficient mode for the engines and then comfort everything else and automatic mode of the gearbox. So I'm gonna call it in three, two, one, go. Oh, this kick down was quicker than mine. Well, you done me dirty there, big guy. Totally, totally destroyed me. I guess this is where it comes into its own and doesn't need the four wheel drive, so that's why it works. All right, Yanni, let's do another rolling race. This time the car's in their sportiest settings manual mode of the gearbox, third gear. Three, two, one, go. then again, but not by quite so much. Wow, can you hear my brakes? <laughs> I haven't got ceramics on this, have I? I don't know, I'd have thought so. You'd have thought it'd come with ceramics. That's part of the thing about it being like Club Sport Lightweight or whatever it's called. I'll come and have a look. Normally, actually, BMW calipers are gold when you have ceramics and they're red. Now they're carbons. Why are you sitting so low down in the car? It looks like you're sitting on the floor. It's these great sports seats, you can get them really low. Well, so I beat you twice there, so I guess it's the brake test decider. Actually, I just want to try one more thing, because I did a bit of a crappy gear change. Okay, just one more, just one more rolling race, come on. Gear change not going to help you anyway, I'll be honest. Okay then, Yanni, let's go again, third gear roll on. Three, two, one, go. Same day. Different toilet. Yeah, wait a second, wait a second. Stay where you are. Have I got carbon brakes? I have got carbons, yeah. I have. You have. Can you tell? I don't think you've got carbons. Yeah, I have. You've got carbons? Yeah, I've carbons. Got carbons. Yeah, yeah, we both have. Where have got carbons? Pardon? We've both got carbons. We've both got carbons, yeah. Great one. Oh, no, it's nice, isn't it? Great. I think it's like this car makes me feel really sick. Really? Yeah, I feel really sick. It's not a good advert, is it? No. Sick, why? Just like motion sickness. Yeah, but it feels like, I man, I drive, I do these race, races all day long. This one's made me feel really sick. How bizarre. Oh. Yeah, because there's something wrong with you. No. Like a little virus. A little bit oh. of inflammation. No, I'm good. No? Yeah, right. no, I'm good. Sure. Right. Is that right? Okay, this race. Come on, Kermit. Definitely in the whole car, yeah. Me. Green Lantern. Okay, now we have a brake test from 100 miles an hour. When we reach the line, full emergency stop, car that stops in the shortest distance, wins. If you'd rather watch a BMW M2 Generations drag race, click on the pop-out banner up there. Find the link in the description below. If you'd rather watch this brake test, stay here, because it's about to happen. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> and today, the synchronised brake stopping occurred. We've got to choose a winner. I don't know. I think it's you. I think you're the winner. I also think it's me and that I'm the winner. But let's just be doubly sure. So, Adam, can you tell us which car won? You have won. Yay! Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like. 
respond to the pinned comment I've put below. And if you want to watch some more videos, click on those windows there. And if you click on that box there, you can get a car wow to compare these cars quarter mile times to every other car we've ever drag raced by checking out the Car Wow Drag Race leaderboard. Thank you for watching.